In this video, methods are demonstrated for quantifying and sequencing single HIV genomes from individuals with viral loads of less than 50 copies per milliliter of plasma. First, a tube containing 7 milliliters of plasma is centrifuged to pellet the virus. RNA is then extracted. To quantify the level of HIV-1, a single copy assay is performed in which the RNA is reverse transcribed loaded onto a 96-well plate with standards and controls, and subjected to quantitative real-time PCR. The level of viremia is then calculated based on the input volume of plasma. As few as 0.3 copies per milliliter can be detected. To characterize the viral population, a single genome sequencing assay is performed, in which cDNA, transcribed from viral RNA, is spread over a 96-well plate to reach an endpoint dilution. Then, nested PCR is performed to amplify viral genomes. If 30% or fewer of the PCR reactions are positive for a given sample, amplification of a single copy of cDNA is indicated. Those samples are then sequenced to reveal the nucleotide sequence of individual viral genomes. The high sensitivity of these techniques enables us to monitor the level of viremia in patients with undetectable HIV-1 RNA by the standard assays and understand the mechanisms of natural control. Though we use these methods to study HIV with different primers and an internal virion standard, the same method can be used to study other viruses as well. Generally, this method is challenging because it is difficult to isolate virus from large volumes of plasma and it takes a DNA-free environment to avoid false positives. 